Mm, mm, no. School. Sleep. Hey, sleepyhead. <laughs> you sound like you're still in bed. I'm already here. Huh? I'm here at the pizza place, where we're supposed to have our first date by 10.30 a.m. Uh, that... That's like two more hours away. Let me sleep. I don't know how to tell you this, but it's already 10.45. Oh, what? Oh, sorry, sorry, I'll get going. Your time. <laughs> How can he be so shameless? I mean, like, seriously? Uh, <laughs> Rose? This is not a big deal. He's a delinquent anyway. I can see faces like that by the gas station two blocks away. You know what? Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Anyway. Daisy, does 10.30 work okay? Wait, are you even dressed up yet? Uh, yeah. Where is it again? Dawn's. Oh, the pizza place? <laughs> no, we're gonna eat at the shoe store. Oh, okay. <sighs> no, Daisy. Whatever, yes, the pizza place. Ah, okay, I'll tell Ivy. Hey. Mm, yeah? Um, Rose said the shoe store- Oh no, wait, it was the pizza place. The pizza place by 10.30. Mm-hmm, yeah, fine. Bye, see you there. Bye! Yeah? I told Ivy. Huh? Wait, who's this? Natalie? Yeah, this is Natalie. Natalie Ivy? Oh, bye. Yeah, Daisy, what's up? I told Ivy. <laughs> yeah, and anything else? Uh, no. Oh, <laughs> sweet. So that was basically for nothing. Yeah, I'll see you there. Are we seriously eating pizza first thing in the morning? Might as well. I mean, then we'll just shop and drink coffee afterwards. I guess. Isn't... That Miguel? Oh my god, you're right. What's he doing here? Ugh, Miguel. Rose, what if he's meeting his girlfriend? <laughs> no way. With how he is, there is absolutely nobody who will last in a relationship with him. Besides, even if he did have one, there's absolutely no way he wouldn't break up with her to be with me. Like, have you ever seen a girl as great as me? Yeah, please. Mm, I've seen these before in movies. I know exactly what's going on. It's weird, right? Like, how can anybody do that to Rose? Anyone, like, any person would rather date Rose than anybody else. So what if he's not a person? He's like E.T., but without the long fingers. And he's exploring Earth and eating pizza because it reminds him of his UFO. There's um, a connection there somewhere. <laughs> I think there's a connection between your brain and wallpaper paste. Shut up, Natalie. Now, come on. Let's get going. I want to see what's going on here. 
Look at that, he's obviously talking to his girlfriend. You'll never see him smile that wide if it was somebody else. He's like totally in love. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not in a million years. That isn't right. There is no way he would pick someone else over me. I mean, come on. I'm gorgeous. I told you he was an alien. <laughs> you know what? I don't even care about him anymore. But he embarrassed me. Never in my life have I ever been shamed like that before. Huh? Well, what are you doing here? I never knew someone like you could be a detective. <laughs> you know what? Knowing you, it's probably because you're too lonely to have any friends to get out with you. A <laughs> delinquent like you? <laughs> Please. There is no way you're out here on a date. I mean, who would even date somebody like you? You don't even look like someone who's able to love. And I only took pity on you? When I asked you to be my partner because I felt bad for you. Wow. You're not only a detective that can come up with these rash theories, but apparently you're also a fortune teller. I shouldn't be surprised, seeing how fake and tacky you look. It matches pretty well. Look here, punk. Both of you say that when you look like that. Your face is nothing special. Hey, guard dog. I never wanted to interact with you in my life. You're the ones that came up to me, especially Miss Cruella DeVille, that suddenly insulted me when I rejected her offer to be my partner. Now if you've got nothing more of substance to say, which I know you don't, leave me alone. By the way, I am here on a date, Alex. Yeah? Oh, did you receive my text earlier? Yeah, obviously. <laughs> oh, uh... Uh, hi guys, what are you guys doing here? Um, excuse me, but we, we should, should be the ones, ones asking, asking you that. guys. I'm pretty sure I told you guys we'll be doing- On a date, obviously. Isn't that apparent? What? Alex, I've got to tell you something about him. He's not what he says he is. Watch out. Stop pushing that agenda delinquent. There's no way Alex would ever date a lowlife. Oh really? How come I can do this, then? <gasps> Alex, you- Uh, I'm sorry, Alex. I, I- my- my thoughts won me over. I shouldn't have done that. I'm- I'm really sorry. I mean... I was caught off guard. I mean, why did you even do that anyways? What happened before I came here? While I was waiting for you, they came up to me. I was still quite pissed at the red one for what she did to me. And today, she insulted me again. I wanted to shut them up. But I got you involved in it as well. I'm really sorry. It's the Natalies. I mean, surely they won't hate me too much. Hopefully. You know, I did think over what you said about my friendship with them. Maybe this is the last straw? <sighs> Surprisingly though, despite the horrors I can imagine them doing because of this, I'm... I'm pleased they got silence finally. <laughs> I'm really sorry about the kiss. I told you it's fine. It's not like it was on the lips anyways. Nice way of pretending a kiss though. Kissing the skin above my top lip. <laughs> I'm starving. Eat as much as you like. It's my treat. I'll take that as a challenge then. Uh, Rose? Don't even! Never seen Rose like that before. She's probably been mind controlled. Let's buy tinfoil. <sighs> this is. Ugh. You know what? Ugh! I mean, I can't believe he would actually do something like this! We should let Rose calm down. Yeah, I agree. <sighs> she will be fine. That's how it's gonna be. Then so be it. Oh, what's what gonna be? Whatever. 
I'll get my chocolate mocha macchiato triple chocolate tiramisu deluxe jumbo size. And I'll get tea. By the way, Natalie, what should we even do for our play? I don't have any idea. We can do the three little pigs! I really like that story. Uh, Natalie, it's a duo play. Yeah! Wait, what did I say? There's only two of us? Oh, well, um, how about you, Natalie? What's your plan with Heather? Ugh, don't even bring her up. She's so not it. I mean, she's such a loser. I couldn't even be bothered talking to her. She's like if 2% milk came to life. And I mean, watching Mr. Green Day single strand of white hair swinging against the AC wind is much more entertaining than she is. But you'll need those grades, won't you? Mr. Bennett is not an easy teacher to please. Not even donations make him bat an eye. Whatever. I'll think of something. I definitely won't be working with her if it's the last thing I do. I... I'm stuffed. Did I stuff you well? Mm-hmm. Thanks. That... that was yummy. No worries. And sorry. Oh, look at that! It's been a while since I've been in this part of the city. I totally forgot about this arcade. I remember going here when I was younger. My dad and I used to hang in here a lot. Cedric, my best friend too. Funny, you kinda remind me of him. <laughs> Where are we going? To the arcade. Duh. Aren't we supposed to work on- shh, 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 shh. Um... Come on, I brought my card. Let's get it topped up. Wait, the whole- Hi, can I get this topped up, please? Yeah, sure. How much should I top it up by? 60 would be fine. Thanks. All good. Just give me a moment here. And here you go. Thanks. Have fun with your day. Ah, yes. <laughs> so... Where should we start? You decide. No you. No you. No you. No? Ugh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, fine. Hmm... Let's, uh, let's start over there. I'll just go to the toilet quickly. Yup, yup. Hello. Can I just check to see how many tickets I've got in the card at the moment? Hold on. Right now you've got 6,256 tickets. Oh yeah, thank you. Also, how much would it be for that plushie? Oh, for that one right there, it's 7,000. Ah, okay. Can I just top this card another 40? Yeah, sure. Here. Thanks. He's just a little kid. <laughs> Yo! Oh, you're back. I'll just finish this. Where are we heading off to next? Uh, yes! Finally! Oh, uh, yeah. Let's just wander around the city. You can head outside. I'll just use the bathroom real quick. Oh? Uh, okay. I'll be right outside then. Yo! I'm back again. Can I get that plushie? Oh, I see what you did. <laughs> well... Here you are. Have fun. Will do. Thanks. Wait, what? Huh? Come on. I kind of want to eat dessert. I know a good ice cream place around here. You like ice cream? Yeah, I do, but... Wait, wait a minute. The, the plushie... Come on, quickly. It's gonna close soon. <laughs> hey. Hmm? What was that earlier? 
The what earlier? The plushie. Duh. Ah, uh, well, I saw you staring at it earlier and figured you wanted it. Your eyes were like, Oh my god, that's so cute. It's like as cute as me. I want it. Hey, I do not at all sound like that. Yeah, I don't agree with that. Ah, uh, you know what? For a day to plan out our project, there was no planning involved. Nor project. Well, I did say it was a day. Oh, shut up. Seriously, though. What are we gonna do for that play? I don't really watch plays all that much. I don't have a lot of ideas, to be honest. Same here. I wonder if we should just make our own play or just do a rendition of an actual play. Let's have a think about it next time. Let's just enjoy the rest of the day. It's due in a few weeks away. But I guess you're right. It's rare that we enjoy days like these. See? I'm right yet again. Uh, I hate it when you're right. Of course. Of course I'm right. When have I ever been wrong? Me, 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 me. I'm a gale. Me, 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 me. Hey, where did you learn that, huh? How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> Miguel? Hey, um, thanks for today. No problem at all. No, no, I, I mean it. It's been the most fun I've had in so long that I can't even remember. You also made me realize a lot of things today. Thank you for everything. Oh, and I need to pay you back for what you spent today. Nah, no need to pay me back. I did it because I wanted to anyways. Also... I had a lot of fun with you today. No, but, like, I didn't even contribute anything for any of the stuff we got. I need to pay you. I told you, it's fine. But... You know what? How about you treat me next time, then? Okay? Fine. Hey, thanks again. Careful on your way home, okay? See you Monday. Good night. See ya. Alex. Hi, Rose. I hope you're not mad. It's not what you think it is. <laughs> I don't, I don't care, care about whatever you and that rat, rat have going on. on. But don't but you, you ever bring him up, up ever, ever again, again. Understand? understand? I I don't really want to join, but it'll only get worse if I don't. Alex! What was that earlier? Yeah, Alex, that was so surprising. It was more surprising than when Mom told me her name wasn't Mom. Guys, it was nothing. He's a very impulsive person, and he just wanted to get you off his back. Well, you got that right. That lowlife can go rot in the sewers for all we care. Yeah, he can totally just go back to whatever weird planet he came from. I wouldn't even care. Like then... I could finally take this tinfoil hat off of my head. <laughs> Listen, don't ever bring him up again. Ever. I don't want to see even a thread of hair from him. I don't ever want to see you with him. And if I do, I swear, you know the consequences, Alex. What do you even see in that delinquent except his dollar shop face? Are you friends? And you enjoyed your time together? I hate him. He looks like a retired, mediocre extra character of an old forgotten puppet show. I don't even consider him as a friend. All of it was just a put on. Is that what you wanted me to say? Yes, I did enjoy my time with him, and yes, I consider him a friend. Enough! Oh, so what? I'm supposed to be called? What? Oh, I'm the problem again. I've never been correct. <laughs> You're always right! Stop making this about yourself! What, so I'm supposed to take everything you say to me and not get when mad? have I not been enough? <laughs> I've done everything for this family, and this is how you repay me. <sighs> hmm. 
Oh. Hey. Yo. How was your day? Actually, it's one of the best days I've ever had. Oh. How come? It's one of the only days when I've actually felt free. I hung out with a friend today. I felt like I've known him for years. It's crazy. I felt so at ease. Oh. That's good. Any quest you're doing at the moment? Oh, yeah, actually. It's a pretty high-level quest. It's a bounty. We need to go to the Snowy Alps. Apparently, this is the last place that the Great Yeti was seen. This is the first time I've ever hunted a Yeti. I'm kind of scared. It's okay. I'll protect you. Aw. Wait, look! I see it! It's the Yeti! It's running this way! Mix, where are you? Oh, bruh. <laughs> Pick up documents for me. 22 Amno Road. Just tell them my name, Tanks. I'll just eat in the city then. Since I'll be there anyways. Here you go. Thanks for coming. Enjoy. Thank you. Hey, sweetie cakes. S Cedric? What the? 